Uh, moving over towards some of the mid-distance races, Keely Hodgkinson in the women's 800 gets beat. I mean, we were looking at Hodgkinson as like the marquee runner to defeat a thing Mo. Now she loses this race here, runs 158. Mary Mora of Kenya runs 157. Good run for her. She's now run 157 a few times. The women's 800 starting to become a little bit of a toss-up type race. It used to feel like it was kind of an understood. You got a thing one, Hodgkinson, a clear two, and then, you know, whoever three. But now with a thing Mo almost losing to Ajay Wilson and Mara Mora, Mora beating Keely Hodgkinson, we're seeing kind of a little bit of parody coming along. Which gets me excited. Women's eight is going to be not a, a known commodity. We're gonna, it's going to be very, you know, who's going to have it on the day type race. And I like that. Uh, Sage Herder had a good run for the Americans. Runs 158 again. Um, Brooke Feldmeyer breaks two minutes, uh, 159. But yeah, Mora is now coming, turning into a legitimate uh, metal contender. Hodgkinson's still there, you know. She, can't take away what she did last year. She's still going to be in the mix. Still runs 158. Just didn't look like she had it in the final 100. Mora just looked like clearly had a different gear that no one else had. And kind of very similar to the men's 800. Because I want to talk about the men's 800. Okay. 